If Kate don't wear spots. You clean that back window. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> New badges to go on the car. Be right with you guys. We're just getting all set up here. Is that a... Is this safe for paint? I think this is for only glass. We don't have any water spot remover for other stuff. All right, what we got going on here? You have to swipe up on the screen so you can see chats. Hey, Sounds Gaming. Thanks, dude. All right. About to get to work here. Which one do you want to put on? <clears throat> so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do this one first. I'm going to replace it with this one here. Yeah, let's move it closer. So I got new V10 badges for the sides and the new rings for right here. So. Are those V10 ones the matte black or are they the gloss? Matte black. Are these, gloss black. Are the matte black ones the only one you could find? That's the, yeah, that's the only ones I've found. Actually, I, don't, I think they are gloss. They're just, they're gloss. Okay. They're gloss black. All right. Maybe it's just the packaging that they're in that makes it look Yep, yep. So a couple things you're gonna, a couple things we're gonna need first. I got some fishing line, and I may need some gloves. We'll see how hard it is to get off. If it's hard and starts hurting my hands, I'm gonna grab some gloves, some like winter gloves or working gloves, not latex. And I also have my heat gun. I got a. Where's it? There it is. Are you going to use the heater and dental floss to remove the old badges? I'm using the heat gun and I'm using fishing line, dental floss. It may work for newer cars, but this is a 2011 and the front emblem when I took it off, the rings on the front on the hood, it was tough because it was just been sitting on there so long. Start with the R first. That's my 
much easier in the front. Let's see if I can take this off without heating it up. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> do you want to... How do you want to make sure it's level? Oh yeah, shit. Let's t get some tape first. So we can put in a set, same exact spot. Get some painter's tape. But that uh, that new one won't have the, uh, you have to off center it because of the the red badge part on it. Look. What? This red part's added to it, so you're gonna have to. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, I guess we could just measure it. We can measure it and put the tape here. Here's the tape measure. I got tape right here. Do you want some like, do we have goo going? I'm going to use this first to measure the height of it. That didn't work out like I planned. Let's start at the bottom. Right on the edge of the black. And then right there. All right, so that's the height. Go ahead and clean that off. What are you gonna use to get that off? Some goo gone. Spray with some goo gone. I got goo gone right here. We don't have lunch. Do you want a microfiber? Yeah. He's gonna be. Just don't rub too hard. I'll spray the car with some quick detailer too to pick up any remaining oils. Let that soak for a little bit and I'm gonna start on the rings. hurt my hands. Might need some gloves. this with some alcohol too to make sure you get all the stuff off. You know what? The oil so it sticks better. Oh yeah. cha -ching. <laughs> a little soup, it fell. A little souvenir. Alright. So the only chrome that you're going to have on the car is the exhaust tips. For now.
putting the badges on because we're getting ready for a car show. We want to have the badges on. All right. Is that going to come up? some more to make the adhesive line it up like this. Don't go with the only second stick. And you gotta line it up right here. I'm glad that's the height. We're gonna put that on and we'll do another piece of tape going across. This is, uh, M3 Johnny said we need an M or an AMG on the channel. <laughs> wow. <laughs> We got something that's faster than an M and an AMG. We're still in an M. And of course he's got to be blowing over there. Got freaking Mr. Rogers over there with the long run. I don't know what... Nice. If I get an M, I think I'm gonna try to find a uh, like a car that's like hasn't really been taken care of, so it's like a real project car. At least it's coming off pretty easy. Yeah, this this one's coming off easy. It's the these here that are pain. The rings. The ringy beanies. AMG or an M looks better. LOL. Oh and more views because people can relate. Oh my god. This car turns more heads. Like literally. <laughs> it's not only that. That's fun. Yeah, it is really fun. I'm to drive in my, my 5 Series that I had. Don't get me wrong, I love, I love the 5 Series, but... This is a whole different animal. M3 Johnny said bags on the R8. Bags? Nah. Nope. Unless, well, the uh, the mag ride is leaking a little bit, but it's not like crazy that we need to replace it right away. But if something. Maybe coilovers. Yeah, if coilovers. I'm not going to bag it. I'm not going to spend that much money. Because I'm only going to. I'm planning on only keeping it a year, if that. And then get something else. Alright, this isn't. Uh, Maybe some, uh, what do you call it? What? Uh, what do you call it? The erase, the, uh... What are you talking about? Clay bar? Clay bar. Jesus, I can't remember. <laughs> Hold on. I hit that with the clay bar. There's still some residue there. Try it with the clay bar, see if that comes off. I'm going to start with this over here. M3 Johnny said, y'all got to slam it with a smiley face. <laughs> you don't even like the car, Daniel. You freaking slam it. <laughs> Whoa. This is going to be clean right here. It's going to take forever. These rings. Ugh. I saw I saw an E sixty three the other day. It's got AMG rims. <laughs> yeah, my, I have AMG rims. The F ten wasn't low enough. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah. That thing was three fingers off the ground. That's funny. <laughs> I can't 
messed up. Huh? Is that working? That's the light one though, isn't it? Is that the it's coming off. Is it? Oh yeah. Look at that. Look how clean this car is. There's no dirt on this. I've seen people use WD-40 to get the badge residue off. We have WD-40. Yeah, that works, yeah. So if we run out of the... Because we don't have a lot of the, goo, the goof off or whatever it is. It got you. You're the goof off. That's good. These are painted. Hold on. I still see slight residue. We got car meet tonight, so we're trying to get all this on before we go. I think we'll go live on YouTube or sh again. Or should we film? All right. What do you say? WD forty. Yeah. Let's try that. Where's it at? Uh, I know we got some. I just gotta find it. There it is. Um, we got a little bit. There she is. You got it. WD-40. Let's see what M3 Johnny. I think I don't think it was M3 Johnny. It was someone else. Was Man, now M3 Johnny's saying sell the Range Rover. It's our, it's our Greek buddy. The Greek buddy. We got a lot of Greek uh, people that comment on our videos. Hello there. No wonder he said use WD-40, he's Greek. <laughs> I'm surprised he didn't tell me to use Windex. <laughs> <laughs> sell the Range Rover and get an X5M. How about we sell the Range Rover and get a SVR Range Rover? Mm, yeah, they're nice. My wife doesn't like the Range, she wants to Escalade again, a new one. She just likes having a big truck or... Yeah. All right, WD-40. Does it work any better? People use WD-40 for engine bays. <laughs> for, like, engine shine. Yeah, yeah that's you can. They used to do that for detailing boats to make them shine. You use WD-40? No, no, I didn't, but, like, dealerships, when they're, like, delivering a boat, they'll hit it with WD-40 to give it, a, like, a nice shine. Ain't working any better, buddy. M3 Johnny said, Get the X7. The X7, I haven't even seen an X7. Everybody's telling us to get something. I'll be getting another car eventually. You guys gotta buy merch. <laughs> merch, super chats, error thing. Or join our memberships. We got memberships up now. Yeah. Get cool benefits. Right next to the, the subscribe button, it says join. It's cheap, man. What is it? $2.99, $4.99, what is it? Five bucks? I think it's like five dollars a month or then something. Then you get cool, cool uh, badges. What, um... I think that's the BMW logo for uh, M3 Johnny. This is that one come off. What do you, how do you want to do this one? Uh, let's get this... Oh, first so we can clean it, everything off at once. That better be centered. I would I would put tape on it first. Wipe it up and put tape underneath of it. And then box it. So it's centered. Do what? Take tape and box it in. Well, can't do it now. You can. It's gonna come off. I'm scrubbing. Here, get the tape and find the center right here. And put it up here, higher. Cut it off like right there. Let me see it. Hang on. 
also find the height. So that's the center of that. And then right there. So that's going to go in that divot of the new one. All right. Why are you taking that off? Hmm? Now you're not going to know where it goes. No, you go put another one. Give me this. Ugh. I guess I'm going to leave it on there and just tape it back. Just hold it back like that. Put another piece of tape to hold that piece of tape. There we go. DJ Sue True Kid said, nice R8. Thanks, bro. Is that a Lamborghini? Good God, man. What is that, Ferrari? I want to get I want to get a Lamborghini, but then people are going to shit on that, too. <laughs> <laughs> Coming off easy with the heat gun. You think? You want to try some? No. M3 Johnny said, "Need an Army Tricks exhaust." Yep. We're trying to get a sponsorship for an exhaust, but they ain't looking too hot. With COVID, people are. Sh struggling and they don't want to it's hard to get sponsorships i don't know if i like the armatrix exhaust like i've, I've heard better exhaust systems for this car because if you don't get like the note right it's not loud enough what's that other one that we, um, we reached out to with the, with the a um, avior avior yeah they, they're really nice too I think it's Avior. Avior Performance. That's it. All right, now we're getting somewhere now. Yeah, buddy. I'm pretty sure this is it. This one. Yeah. The one with the uh, that red little banner thing. I think those came on the newer ones. Like 2015. No. That's the, an RS badge. The facelift ones, I think it came on. Don't pull away too hard because the microfiber might stick to the tape and. M3 Johnny said, get custom plates. We can't. They're not doing them because of COVID. We tried to go. I think we tried to get like thick R8, but the since COVID is doing it, is going on right now, the MVA is not giving them out. They're not making them. They shut that department down temporarily, they said. You think they're going to open it back up anytime soon? I don't know. We could check online and see. Everything's starting to open up again, so we should... Uh... If we can get a custom plate, what do you think it should be? It's got to be seven total. Uh, no more than seven. No more than seven letters or numbers. Thick R8. What do you mean, what? Thick R8. Let's see if anyone else can come up with something like funnier. M3 killer. <laughs> <laughs> M killer. All right, last strand here. I got smoking. Smoking. I'm on fire. Low R8, quiet R8. <laughs> Put, I'm gonna eat a bag. <laughs> eat a bag. 
need a bag. I think you should put a thing of tape down here before you do anything else. Like just put like a thing of tape so you know it's level when you put the it's new bag on. It's gonna come off when I spray it. You no, know, it won't as long as you stick it good. Sticky sticky, hold on. Take some of this. Sticky sticky. I'll put this right here. And then we're gonna have to get window tip ASAP. We are thinking about window tint. I'm just not gonna tint the back. The back window is not getting tinted, man. It's gonna hide the beautiful engine. That looks straight from there. <laughs> what do you guys say? Is it straight? I can't see shit. Let's measure it. Go get the uh, level out. <laughs> well, where's the measuring tape? Should be level. That's like my. So one and a half. Gotta come down a little bit. Straight to me right there. One and a half. One and a half. You want to hit this real quick with that alcohol and so we can stick it on? Yes, sir. Seems straight to me. Oh, you're strong. What, uh... If I get a BMW, what BMW should I get? We've already gone through this. I don't know. I don't know if I should get an E92. This, which one's the dirty one? This one. That's with the goo going. This one's destroyed. You know that. What are you talking about? Look at all that. He's like, you can't use this again. You gotta throw this out. That's one of my good ones, too. Well, what do you think this was gonna happen? What do you think this was gonna happen, Evan? Use the clay bar. I don't want to try this in the wall. Three thirty five E six hundred plus E ninety or E ninety two only. Anyone on here from uh, Maryland? The gray one is for more is more um, aggressive than the blue one. How are you looking? Coming off? Eh, not really. No. Let's wipe it. Some of the clay is getting stuck on it. Get um. Is that coming off now? 
I mean, that helped loosen it up a little bit. It's getting there. If I get a second car, M3 Johnny said E92 M3 with a supercharger will smoke the RE. <laughs> okay, but the RE with the supercharger won't be able to sit, won't be able to get gapped by a. What did he say? A what? He said an E92 M3 with a supercharger will smoke the RE. We slap a supercharger on this, it won't. <laughs> or twin turbo it. Twin turbo. The thing is, if I do all those mods, it's going to lose the value. The people that bought these cars, especially V10s, they uh, they don't want it all modified. TCG said, love your content. Thank you, sir. Or ma'am. Ma'am. Yep. What is... You missed a spot right there. Oh, now you're going to tell me what... You missed the spot. The boss, the and three Johnny said not worth it on that car. About twin turboing it, or I'm guessing it's about twin turboing it. All right, hit it with the uh... alcohol. No, with the uh... what do you call it? The clay bar again. Can't even think straight. We're gonna have to clean this up again. Okay. Go back, and after we're done this, we'll do the side, the V10 ones. Turn on the side. Dump the old bottle on it. Get it off? Yep. We should um I got hit with some alcohol. Blame it on the a a a a a alcohol. It's still oily up here. Is this done? Yeah. All right. So this is uh. <clears throat> do that one first. The thing is about this. Is that if you want it to be, what's it called? If you want it to be, do you want it like that? Or the or it to line up with the tape. I put line this up with the, that. Line it with there. <clears throat> yeah, line. Or I think that's too far up. Do you think it should be down? Yeah, th this should be on top of the tape. So you might need to cut this. <laughs> so this this one in the divot, like so. Check that, like right there. Yeah, that's fine, right there. How's that look? Hmm? It's stuck now. Yeah. It's done. Huh? Cut it, like right there. Yeah. I think it looks good. Right. Center to me? Yep. Put the other badge. 
Do you want ammo? Yes. Ammo is a. Uh, ammo's R8 is a uh, V8. How do you want it to go on? You're gonna have to take that piece off too. All right. So this is where it. Yeah, let me take this off. Just line that up with that. You see. Make your left side come down a little bit. Right there. Right there? Yep. Right there. Go ahead. Does the eight look a little slanted? Maybe we can get the heat gun in. Right there. Take the tape off a little better. Booyah! So much better. So much better. All right, let's get started on the other end. M3 Johnny. I'm 18. I'll be 19 in July. Evan's going to be starting his detailing company here in Maryland soon. Go ahead. You want to give a shout out to your, did you launch your Instagram yet? Is yeah. it live? Yeah, hold on, let me pull it up. If you guys want to follow his uh, Instagram, uh, he's building his website now. Is it, is it live, is it your website? Yeah, it's live. Alliant Auto Detailing. It's Evan. He's starting his own company. And also the website. What's the website? I'll pull it up. AlliantAutoDetailing.com. I got different pages on here, different services. When are you starting that, Evan? In the summer? Yeah. After this semester, I'll be doing that. All right, let's move this over to the uh, side. How are we gonna? It should be charged. All right. Off to the V10. Kind of looks black in the picture already. Going back to Tacticals comment, I wanna. I do wanna try some of Ammo's. Uh, products. M3 Johnny asks us if uh, wheels are coming. No, I'm probably gonna get. I'm probably gonna just get these redone. Yeah, they're a little scuffed up. You guys think I'm loaded or something, don't you? <laughs> Man, we need sponsorships for this. <laughs> God, the new grill looks so good. You show them the new grill. You can. Oh, it does look black from here. This is the new grill we just put on. Looks so much more aggressive. M3 Johnny said, if you get an R8, you can afford parts. Let's see if I even need the heat gun. Nope. Put the 
of one go. Well, I'll find it later. He said, sell the Range Rover and uh, buy, buy a Parts? rule a, a, a CRV. <laughs> Oh my God. <laughs> and use the extra money to buy car parts. <laughs> I don't think that'll fly very well with her. She'd be like, you're doing what? She'd be like, I don't think so. This is works better with the heat gun. Just goo going. Doesn't work. Mm -hmm. Also, mark the gap between the V and the 10, unless the new badge comes in one piece. Yeah, it comes in one piece. Yeah. It's not one piece, it's, it's already lined up. The one's a little bit crooked, though. So you might have to turn the one a little bit. I would think the sun beating on this thing would have made this a little bit easier to come off. I mean, it was, I didn't have to heat it up the top of the numbers, though. I think I should just let it, let it bake. No, it's not going to get hot enough. Man, it's nice out today. What is it, like 60 degrees? No, it looks like 70. Does the R8 have carbon ceramics? No, it has steel brakes, steel rotors. I think the newer one, the newer ones only have carbon ceramics, right? Yeah. 15 and up, I think. And the 14s and up have the dual clutch. That's the thing I like about driving this car, even though it's a manual, it's not gated. It still drives like, it's so old, like if you're at a light, if you let go of the brake, it'll still roll. It almost drives like a manual still. I forget what that, what is it called? That technology? What? What are you talking about? I'm talking about the, like, the, the, how it drives like that. It's like, like a manual, even though it's an automatic. And so Johnny said, what's next after the R8? I don't know. We don't know yet. It depends how many people start, uh, how much we grow, how much, uh, you know, at the end of the day, how much money we make from it. <laughs> if it makes sense, I'd like to get a Lamborghini Gallardo. If not, then, I don't know, back to... Maybe the new BMW, maybe like new just BMW. a bunch of BMWs, huh? Maybe the new BMW. Oh, yeah, maybe a new BMW. Because I was, I looked at the uh, was it the four, the uh, the, the M430. I was looking at them. No, you were looking at the the new M3s too, with the big grill, the Beaver grill. Yeah, but the M, M the M430 had it too, a black one. Uh -huh. And right. plus, they have manual transmissions. I don't think it needs a. I don't think I need to play about it. Make sure you put the off channel one a little bit. 
is a little bit crooked. Let's see how we're going to do this. So the V Looks good. Yeah, buddy. All right. Show me, bro. What was the miles per gallon on the F10? <laughs> uh, like 15? No, I think it was like 17 miles per gallon. Not after it was. Uh, after it was tuned, probably after like. Stage two was probably like. 13? 14? I mean, if you drove it aggressively. The miles per gallon on the Mercedes is like 15. Evan already showed you the new grill, right? Every, all, right. all right, now to this side. Let's see if I can get this thing set up. Make, making you all dizzy? There we go. She said. Oh, all right. Plugged back in. Alrighty. Off to the side. Put tape on it? Shit, no. Well, you can do it now. Still residue on it. You can still line it up. I can't find it. There's just... There you go. What do they think? Should we wrap the car? What? Should we wrap the car? No, I'm not putting the, I'm leaving the Audi hood, the emblem on the front off. <clears throat> I think it looks better. Have you guys thought about a budget build for a G35 or something? G35, like a Infinity? I think so. Or a Z. I was thinking about a budget build for a second car for me but it'd be a german car it wouldn't be a uh an asian or jdm jason said he didn't want to go to the meet why i don't know he needs to get out of the house that boy he's gonna be sitting in his 
inside such a nice day. Why isn't he out here? He's probably sitting in his room watching this. What? He's probably sitting in his room watching us. <laughs> it's a nice day. Huh? You talking to me? Evan, can you bring my soda? It's sitting up there. I can't see the screen if they're asking anything. I bet you the soda will take the, the adhesive off <laughs> better. Pull this back and line it back up. You got what? Yeah, pull the tape back. Still a little bit of residue. Break it up that one. Are we gonna hit it with a quick detail one more time? The car? Yeah, where we put the emblem for. Did you wipe it? Yeah, I'm bring right. bring the emblem. That's it. Dunsky. Looks so much better with the black, the gloss black badges. It matches the uh, carbon fiber. Carbon fiber. So we're going to hit this with quick detailer again. We're going to put the uh, emblems, badges. Let me see that side again. Okay, looks straight to me. 
here and grab this. All right, that's a wrap. Thank you guys for joining us. We're gonna go to this meet tonight. I don't know if we should go live on YouTube or maybe just our Instagram, if you guys are interested in seeing it. Drop in the comments below and maybe we'll go live at this meet. A lot of uh, BMWs, um, Audis. It's a, it's a Euro, Euro group and- No, it's not. It's not? Not the one that we're going to this weekend. I mean, not tonight. tonight. But that there's going to be. The Harford Euros is... The one's but luxury tonight, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, but there's, there's going to be a lot of European cars there. BMWs, Audis, uh, Volkswagens. No, I'm sure there's going to be uh, JDM, cars, JDM there. cars there, too. There's going to be all kinds of cars there. So if you guys are interested in watching, let me know. Either we're going to go live on YouTube or we might just record for another video. Or we just might go live on our Instagram. We don't know yet. We'll see how we feel about it. But thanks again, guys. Enjoy your weekend, your Sunday. We will see you in the next video. Live stream or video. Live stream or video. We don't know. We like this going live thing. All right, guys. Bye. See ya.